Question number 4 says that a pen stand made of wood is in the shape of a cuboid with 4 conical depressions to hold pens. The dimensions of the cuboid are 15 cm by 10 cm by 3.5 cm. The radius of each of the depressions is 0.5 cm and the depth is 1.4 cm. We have to find the volume of the wood in the entire stand as shown in the figure 13.16. So this is the cuboidal wooden block that we have in which there are four conical depressions that are made so that in them the pens can stand. Now this is the top view but if we look from inside this is how the four conical depressions are. So to get the total volume of the wood in the entire stand we will have to subtract the volume of these four conical depressions from the volume of the entire cuboidal wooden block that we have. So with this information we can write that the volume of wood in the pen stand will be equal to the volume of cuboidal block that we have minus 4 times the volume of the conical depressions that are made so that the pens can stand in them. So it's very easy to find the volume of the cuboid with the formula L times B times H and the volume of a cone can be found with the formula 1 by 3 pi r square and we'll take the height for the cone as H1 because the height of the cuboid and the height of the cone, the conical depression will not be same and when it's multiplied with 4 we can get the total volume of the four conical depressions. So we'll first try to find out the volume of the cone. The cone looks like this, which has got a depth of 1.4 centimeters and the radius 0.5 centimeters. We can directly substitute these values back into the formula. So first for LBH we substitute 15 times 10 times 3.5 minus 4 times 1 by 3 times 22 by 7 times 0.5 the square and times 1.4. This and this gets cancelled, we get 0.2. On further calculation, we get the product of 15 times 10 times 3.5 as 525 and the product of this as 1.47. Doing the subtraction gives us the difference as 523.53 cm cube. And this is the volume of the wood in the entire pen stand after scooping out or by after subtracting the volume of four conical depressions from the volume of the cuboidal block that we initially had. To learn more about how QMath can help you crack school and board exams, Explore QMath Leap, a live online classroom program run by highly experienced and committed teachers.